stay cool. Science is like magic and magic tricks. Astronomy is much like Hogwarts, a school of wizardry and science craft. Yeah, that's right. Welcome to Asteroid Challenge Fight Club. This is a Thor News presentation. Doesn't matter what I believe. Hit the button, baby. Thor News presents. Guys, I'm bringing the party to you. Oh, joy. Because the sun's hot. I don't know if you know that. You do now. Congratulations. It's time to kick back, smoke them if you got them and open a fresh can of Mountain Doom. Strange space weather makes for strange earth weather. Hey, somebody get the top professional science communicators on the science communicator phone and have them wake their ass up. Pay attention to the sun. Maybe they can tell us exactly what is going on in this double peaked minimal solar maximum that has gone on far too long for record books. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Super Celestial Sunday. And I am your host, Thor, your premier solar scientist. That's right, I don't have a PhD. I just have the know-how to look at things and go, that is abnormal. We got a lot on our plate today, so I'm gonna Try not to stay too bogged down on any one particular video, so that way I can be light and nimble on my feet. We've got an X-Class flare that popped off when October 19th. X-Class flare. We have a tradition here at Thor News. We name the X-Class flares after X-Men. I'll get to that in a moment. It does look like Wolverine claws in the sun, though. So, you gotta put him in contention. You've got Comet Sighting Springs. Passing so close to Mars. It's making it rain. Comet particles. You've got the sun and giant sunspot 2192. We've got Venus taking her time and she seems to be always ready for her close-up Mr. DeMille. And while professional science is saying hey watch Comet Sighting Spring. Hey watch Rosetta and the Philly in 67P I'm saying, remember the sun? Yeah, the sun's important. There's a lot of shit going on. These are crazy days indeed. And we got auroras popping off all over the world. Well, that's not true. Just at the north and south poles. Sit me down. We've got filaments that snake up and down all the way across the sun. We've got a giant coil bigger than anyone I've ever seen. It's been sitting there for days. We got the sun throwing shoes at us. And that sunspot is nasty looking. Shafts from heaven. We have a treasure trove of camera artifacts, anomalies, lens flares, and captured Bigfoot swamp gas. Those are some gorgeous auroras. Look at that giant magnetic loop. Look at that giant magnetic loop. So I came up with a scientific term the other day. I called it solar erection. Because that is what we have been seeing on the sun for several days. The sun is doing it Johnson style. Maybe it's just a pillar on the sun. See, there it is. Or the sun has a flagpole and we're waiting for it to fly its flag. Attention. That ain't normal. Giant shit sticking off the sun is not normal. That is too big. That is what she said. It's incredible. That's what she said. It's like a painting. Whoa. That looks more like an X-Class tear than an X-Class flare. You know, Comet Sighting Spring is a lot like the Super Bowl. If they hyped it up and then never showed you any pregame, or actually probably even any of the game, that's why I like the sun. We get to watch it, at least until all the cameras go down. 
Right, right. Heck, Yizzle? Sure is a crappy time for a bunch of sun cameras to be down. The roof. The roof. The roof is on fire. Snap, crackle, pop. There's a lot of activity on the sun. I think the sun's trying to be a hip-hop artist and is pushing out fresh beats. Look at the sun. Dropping it like it's hot. Enter the dragon sun. Enter the dragon sun. I'm a pretty smart guy. My Jedi instinct is smarter. It's like science and religion are in a barroom argument about to brawl over God and the Big Bang. I'm like, hey dudes, A, you can have both, and B, check out the sun. Why'd you guys forget about the sun? You scared of the sun? Well, whatever happens next, after the ugly part, it's gonna be beautiful. Don't go chasing waterfalls. Please stick to the rivers and the forests you used to. And there, I saw an angel standing in the sun. Welcome to Enter the Sun Dragon.